everyone, welcome back to another Animal Crossing Pocket Camp video. A little while ago Nintendo posted a major update announcement for Animal Crossing Pocket Camp, so I thought it would be fun to take a look at it and we can talk through all the fun new stuff being added to the game. So the first thing being added to the game is a huge increase in the number of animals you can have staying at your campsite. While previously we were only able to invite 8 animals to our campsite, that number has now doubled and we can now invite up to 16 villagers. That's even more villagers than the max amount you were ever able to have living in your town in Animal Crossing. The original Animal Crossing on the GameCube allowed us to have up to 15 villagers, and now Pocket Camp has just beaten that record. Of course Pocket Camp is just an app and wouldn't usually be compared to a fully developed console game, so I think this is pretty impressive. Impressive. I always had so much trouble picking my favourite villagers to have in my campsite, so I'm super excited to be able to invite so many more friends. Next up, the new smart device widget. There is now a new Pocket Camp smart device widget that you can use to decorate your home screen. This widget allows you to bring a little bit of the campsite onto your home screen, showing different animals with their own little messages for you. This widget is so lovely and it even changes appearance with the time of day, bringing it even more of that lovely Animal Crossing vibe. I love this so much, as someone who loves to decorate their home screen with cute pictures and widgets. I can't wait to have a little bit of Animal Crossing on my screen. Seeing the villagers messages will definitely give me a bit more positivity when I open my phone too, and it just looks so cute! The next thing being added to the game in this update is the new Pocket Planner. There is now a new in-game planner available which will show players in-game event schedules and item information. You'll no longer have to go online to quickly find info about the latest events, and instead can find out directly from inside the game. Now it will be so much easier to remember events that are going on in the game and check release dates for items you might be interested in. I know this is going to be super helpful for me in knowing what days I want to play or record a video based around what events are on and what items are available, and I think this will be super helpful for younger players too who maybe don't have access to social media so haven't been able to check the Animal Crossing Twitter page or subreddit for event news. They can now do so inside their game without having to go online, and I just think that's amazing. Next up, there is now a new Pocket Camp membership plan. The Merry Memories plan will unlock even more Pocket Camp planner features. You can buy more designs and customise your planner with different styles. In the announcement video they also said that you'll get one free design as a bonus when you first sign up to this plan which is really exciting. There's also a huge variety of stickers available for the planner in the sticker shop which are all super cute. Subscribers to this plan will also get lots more seasonal event rewards as well as receiving 20 leaf tickets per month. This membership plan seems so sweet and it only costs 99 cents per month which I think might make it the cheapest pocket camp club membership right now. I'm not too sure on that but I'm pretty sure it is. I love that and as someone that loves journaling and stationery and stickers. The Pocket Camp team really knew how to get me interested in this one, and I think I just might have to check it out myself. <laughs> Something else really cool they've added in this update is the ability to link your smart device's pedometer with the game, so you can record your daily step count in the planner. If you do a lot of walking, the animals will tell you how well you're doing and encourage you. This is so wholesome! One of my goals this year is to go out on more walks, and I think this update will definitely give me some more motivation to do so, and it's so nice that this game can encourage people to get out more and take some more steps and just be more healthy. Okay, and the final thing I wanted to show you all today wasn't actually shown in this update announcement video, but was posted on on the Pocket Camp Twitter page and I thought it was pretty interesting. So on the official Twitter page they posted a statement basically stating that a lot of players have been pretty upset with the maximum inventory limit for furniture and don't have any more space. Which is actually a huge deal in this game considering the main thing we do in Pocket Camp is collect furniture to decorate with, so if we have no room to do that anymore we can't really play anymore. So the team have said that they recognise this issue and want to upgrade the inventory limit but unfortunately are having trouble doing so because the game would no longer be able to run properly. This seems like a very difficult situation for them, so instead they are actually planning to offer the warehouse feature of the Pocket Camp Club furniture and fashion plan for free to all players. I think this was a really great idea on their part and actually really nice of them. I think a lot of game developers would maybe see this issue and just hope it encourages more players to pay for the plans to get more storage because that way they'd make more money and they are a business after all. But I'm really happy they've taken a completely different route to that and they've listened to the players and are now offering this feature for free because I think that's how it should be. They also said that they'll be adding additional benefits for players who are already subscribed to the furniture and fashion plan. I guess so it doesn't feel like those players are wasting their money, which is really great to hear as well. Unfortunately they didn't say too much else on that or when it will become available, but they said they will provide us with more information in the game at a later time, so that's something to look out for in the future. So that's everything being added in this latest Pocket Camp update. I think all these new features are so cute and exciting. I'm genuinely so excited for the new Pocket Camp widget, it's just the smallest thing, but I don't know why I'm really excited to have some more Animal Crossing on my home screen. I think adding the option to link our pedometer with the game is such a good idea as well. That's something that I've never actually considered adding into Animal Crossing. 
but I think it's such a great idea. Like, can you imagine if they added a pedometer into Animal Crossing New Horizons and you were able to get rewards and keep messages from your villagers because of how many steps you've been taking? I just think that would be the cutest thing ever. That would genuinely encourage me to go out and walk way more and take so many more steps. And I think actually adding a pedometer to Animal Crossing is such a cute idea because Animal Crossing is all about enjoying nature and going out and exploring the world. And I just think it's such a great game to add that to. And I'd absolutely love to see this added into New Horizons or any of the other Animal Crossing games in the future. Let me know in the comments what you think of this update. Do you like the look of these new features? Will you be trying out the new Pocket Camp Club plan? And what are you most excited for? Let me know your thoughts in the comments because I'd love to hear them. I know this was just a short video today guys, but I hope you enjoyed it anyway. Thank you all so much for watching. Before I go, I would just like to say an extra special thank you to my amazing Patreon supporters for supporting me this month. I love and appreciate you all so so much and I'm so grateful for your support. It helps me out way more than you'll ever realise. And to the rest of you, thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to take care of yourself. Thank you so much for being patient with me while I was on my break. I hope you're having a super lovely day. If you enjoyed this video, please do consider leaving a like and subscribing. Only if you want to though. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll speak to you in my next video. Bye! Look at your eyes.